Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Head Chase Games again. And welcome to Dragon Age Inquisition Part 3. Shall we begin? Absolutely. Okay, we last up here, we just defeated a giant green rock, so... Or a crystal diamond, I guess. I like to call it Kryptonian. I like to call it a Kryptonite, if you will. So right now, we just and we woke up in this uh, little cottage here by an Courtney elf lady. Talk, talk, Courtney. Sorry, Courtney. Uh, lady, and just talks to me about... Uh, basically... Alright, anyway, I'm trying to say is, we woke up here, and now we need to go to another area. So, let's begin. Oh. Hello. No, let's be setting up. Uh, anyway, sorry. Um, right then, we are in this area. Nice. Frostback Mountains, Haven. Nice. Okay, let's go to this direction. I like the snow. I like the lighting of it. It's nice that they actually put bother. He did it. Um, but it's nice that they actually put a little more light color to the game. It's a lot more brighter, a lot more shinier. But I think that's what they did in the, the graphic bar. Avatar wise, uh, they're still not as. Not as good, or not as expressive. But, you know. Have you got completely mad? She should be taken to Val Royo immediately. To be tried by whomever becomes divine. I do not believe she is guilty. The prisoner failed, Seeker. The breach is still in the sky. For all you know, she intended it this way. I do not believe that. That is not for you to decide. Well, we'll Your see about this. Chain her. I want her prepared for travel to the capital for trial. Disregard that and leave us. You walk a dangerous line, Seeker. The breach is stable, but it is still a threat. I will not ignore it. I did everything I could to close the breach. It almost killed me. Yet you live. A convenient result in so far as you're concerned. Have a care, Chancellor. The breach is not the only threat we face. Someone was behind the explosion at the Conclave. Someone most holy did not expect. Perhaps they died with the others. Or have allies who yet live. I am a suspect? You. And many others. But not the prisoner. I heard the voices in the temple. The Divine called to her for help. So her survival, that thing on her hand, all a coincidence. Providence. The Maker sent her to us in our darkest hour. You know, I'm actually kind of with a bloke. Because you barely know me. You, I barely did much, and you're already making me like... I think he has a bit of a good excuse why he's so skeptical about me, because I barely know him. Maybe they can have time to talk with him, you know, get to know him, you know, just a nice chat. And say, look, we're all in a, in a big boat, that very, very scary boat of that green rock thing. But how about we just communicate with each other? How about we just work together and stop it? I will go in jail peacefully and happily after the event happened, okay? So no, no hate, all right? But no, you don't do that, because that would be, I don't know, uh, open-minded and being less judgmental. These type of games have always been the same. Blessed be the maker. Uh, okay. Though all before me is shadow, yet shall the maker be my guide. We lost everything, then out of nowhere you came. Blessed the maker is like the Jesus. The breach remains, world. and your mark is still our only hope of closing it. This is not for you to decide. No. You know what this is, Chancellor. A writ from the Divine, granting us the authority to act. As of this moment, I declare the Inquisition reborn. 
We will close the breach, we will find those responsible, and we will restore order with or without your approval. You know, I don't get this. You're being a little harsh on them for- This is the Divine's this. directive. Rebuild the Inquisition of old. Find those who will stand against the chaos. We aren't ready. We have no leader, no numbers. And now, no Chantry support. But we have no choice. We must act now, with you at our side. Huh? Okay. What is the Inquisition of old, exactly? It preceded the Chantry. People who banded together to restore order in a world gone mad. After, they laid down their banner and formed the Templar Order, but the Templars have lost their way. We need those who can do what must be done, united under a single banner once more. What about the Chantry? But aren't you still part of the Chantry? <laughs> Is that what you see? The Chantry will take time to find a new Divine. And then it will wait for her direction. But we cannot wait. So many Grand Clerics died at the Conclave. No, we are on our own. Perhaps forever. Forever? No. <laughs> if you're truly trying to restore order, that is the plan. Help us fix this before it's too late. Be a leader? Alright then. Well, I always be like a bit of uh, the, sh the next shepherd around here. I mean, the Inquisition. Kind of like it's also the spect, uh, the sp sorry, the spectres, is it? Yeah, the spectres, uh, spectres, the, um, oh, for the sake. In the game Mass Effect, there's a situation or the sanctuary, uh, oh, hold on. Oh, the central, sorry. Sorry. I fly, my pretties! Fly! What is the. the, the... Seek habit and plague the black flu around. The bird flew around this. Plagues! Fly, my pretties! Fly! You have your right to don't trust me. I'm sorry that I'm in this situation mess. But I want to help you out. I'm sorry there's a lot of people lost in here. But I want to help you out. They don't go in that direction. Like, yep. So anyway. Yes, yes, I am. I am cool. Bit of a... Texas. Nice. All right, then let's begin. And I have to be on it. Right then, I am now a the head of the the Yitzkokish thing. The, the, the Sorry, I can't pronounce. I am now the head of the Inquisit. You know who I am. I'm the leader. I'm the. I'm the Spencer. I'm trying to say the master. Okay, the, the top agent of this group, I guess. Uh, and now I got. Guess what I look? New robe. Must make it look fantastic. These are really lovely robes. Should we surrender or? Don't be foolish. We are the Chantry, as much as any Grand Cleric. That prattle from Valeroya isn't the word. 
Right. Anyway, while we're around here, let's um, let's do, do some. Uh, yeah, let's look around and see what they can discover. No, my lady, I don't know where the other nobles are. I suggest you ask Ambassador Montillier. Oh, you're her, Thryn, Inquisition Quartermaster. I'm doing what I can to supply this mess. If you find what I need to fill one of my requisitions, I'd appreciate you bringing it in. Okay. What did you mean when you mentioned requisitions? I'm making this Inquisition run with what we have, but we're not a real army. We're stretched thin on materials, so I've put up a requisition list for anything that could help our people. Here, take a look. You find some iron and a good logging site, maybe Harriet can get our troops better weapons. Farewell. Make a go with you. Yeah, make a go with you. Yeah, so religion like make a go with Anyway, these are the things you can do around here, Thanks you know, anyway. do some side missions to help the cause. Might make you and make the, you know, kind of like um, in Mass Effect, you're helping the Normandy to get stronger, better upgrades. In all that, yeah. Anyway, let's look around here for a moment for this uh, uh, mission. So, um... Yeah, it looks seems to be alright. Looks like a, a decent campsite. Nice decorations. Nice dog there. Dogs. Wait a minute. Feel carefully. I hear something. Are you the gatekeeper? No, no, I'm not really. I'm this is a different story. I'm I'm just really I'm the head of the quiz I'm the equidition person. Okay. Let's talk to around here. Ah, you're awake and out of Lady Cassandra's clutches. And here I paid that little knife ear to inform me the moment you were free. No matter, no matter. Segret, honored to meet you. Thank you for all you've done, and hopefully will still do. Thank you for your kind words. Easily given. Our fate is quite literally in your hands, from what I hear. Anything you need is yours. For a reasonable price, of course. Supplies are a little tight, given the circumstances. Member Lighter Bison? Can I see what you have for sale? Of course. My wares are at the table. Ah, let's go buy something from here. Um, nice. Okay, let's look around, see what we can find. Right then, up there. Uh, yeah, it looks quite nice around here. That's all of that. Uh, scenery. We're not laying siege to anything. That's an excellent point, recruit. To us. Perhaps it will be best for us to have some means to fight back. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, there's a lot of English people around, but it's also what this sort of strange accent called an American. You know, like they're all trying to be like that Steve Blue, you know, the guy who played for the voice of Wolverine. Um I'm the best of what I do. What I do ain't nice. You know, like that kind of person. Anyway, let's talk to this guy. So, now that Cassandra's out of earshot, are you holding up all right? I mean, you go from being the most wanted criminal in Thetis to joining the armies of the faithful. Most people would have spread that out over more than one day. I'm just glad I'm still standing after all that. I still can't believe you survived Cassandra. You're lucky you were out cold for most of her frothing rage. For days now, we've been staring at the breach, watching demons and maker knows what fall out of it. Bad for morale would be an understatement. I still can't believe anyone was in there and lived. If it was that bad, why did you stay? Cassandra said you were free to go. I like to think I'm as selfish and irresponsible as the next guy, but this? Thousands of people died on that mountain. I was almost one of them. And now there's a hole in the sky. Even I can't walk away and just leave that to sort itself out. It's pure luck that I escaped. Good luck or bad? You might want to consider running at the first opportunity. I've written enough tragedies to recognize where this is going. Heroes are everywhere. I've seen that. But the hole in the sky... That's beyond heroes. We're going to need a miracle. Hmm. Absolutely. 
Right then, that was an intriguing talk. Uh, right then, should we talk to any other people around? Yeah? Uh, are you probably bored? Yeah, right now, I'm still alone. Okay, okay, okay. Let's talk to. Let's check out. Um. Oh, wait, yeah, we're gonna speak to the smith. Let's go. Okay, we're right here, the blacksmith place. So, if let's. Let's talk with him. Hermit! Or Herit. Expected you'd be by. I'm Harrit. And everyone knows who you are. How's the new gear fit? I'll survive. Quite well, actually. Sturdy and warm. It's perfect. Good. World's gone mad. Stock armor and blades are good against bandits, but we're not fighting bandits. My gear will see you through demons, apostates, whatever this world throws at you. So, you need custom work. Something special. You bring the materials to us, we'll make it happen. Can you prove my... Oh, sorry. Can you help improve my arms and armor? Yes. You find a new piece, a pauldron or greaves, we'll take care of you. You can't just slap a new hilt on your sword in the field. Bring it here, we'll make sure it's done right and proper. Goodbye. Right. Ah, no, no, then. We talked to that guy. Okay, maybe the last person we can talk to, right? We need to go for the, uh... Mm -hmm. Alright, uh, let's talk around these people right here. The Chosen of Andraste. A blessed hero sent to save us all. I didn't for this. Someone has to pass away. What's, what's, what's wrong? What? what? Spoken nobly indeed. You think I'm mocking you? This age has made people cynical. I've journeyed deep into the fade in ancient ruins and battlefields to see the dreams of lost okay, civilizations. Then. I've watched as hosts of spirits clash to reenact the bloody past in ancient wars both famous and forgotten. Every great war has its heroes. I'm just curious what kind you'll be. Deep. The kind who makes the world a better place. It isn't always that easy, but I wish you luck. I will stay then. At least until the breach has been closed. Was that in doubt? I am an apostate surrounded by Chantry forces in the middle of a mage rebellion. Cassandra has been accommodating, but you understand my caution. Cassandra trusts you. She won't let anyone put you into a circle against your will. Thank you. I appreciate the thought. But now let us hope either the mages or the Templars have the oh, power to hi, the breach. Oh, Oh, yeah. Okay. That was something. Look at the shop here. Find the rest of Israel exploration with this immersion visiting. Yeah, yeah, alright. Sacred asked, told me that he can't let the herbs go for anything less than eight. <laughs> Look who's back from the dead. Again. It has been a rough few days. <laughs> That's an understatement. And more ahead if the weather is any indication. Name's Adan. I'm in charge of keeping our little band here stocked with potions and elixirs. Not that Seeker Pentagast seems to care whether we've got the supplies to actually do that. Is there anything I can do to help out? We're fine as far as raw labor goes. You've more important things to do than tend to me. I only wish I'd been able to find Master Tajin's notes. Old bastard was working on something special. He died at the Conclave, and his notes weren't here. Been too busy dealing with the wounded to look for them. Farewell. Hmm. Talk so to him. Ah, I finished the quest around the base then. Alright then, I'm going to call that off for now. Um, right, that was a bit of a dull experience, but we had to look around the town, should we? And uh, we seem to show around the uh, base area. So, um, let's just go start. Anyway, anyway, thank you for watching. You have been absolutely a pleasure. If you're still watching right now, brilliant. Thank you very much. Feel free to leave any comments, likes, or subscribe if you like. Either way, thank you for watching, and I will see you another time. Y'all take care now.
You take care, lads. Oh, sorry. I'll rephrase it again. Sorry. I am so sorry. Anyway, thank you for watching. You take care.